Here is what I want to leave you with. Each of us grows up in our own way and in our own time. And I want you to think about this in your own terms. But at its center, growing up means being responsible, being accountable, and planning for the future. We in the Senate right now, we must muster the maturity and the wisdom to rise to the challenge of addressing global warming. We need to be responsible, we need to be accountable, and we need to plan for the future of our planet. When we were all children, our home was our entire world. It didn't matter if our home was a one-room apartment or a giant mansion. Our home that we lived in was our entire world. That home met all our needs. And as we grew older, our home expanded to include our community, our city, our state, our nation, and the world. Now we must take it a step further. If we don't expand the limits of our vision to include the planet Earth as our home, then we may lose our home as we know it. And I will do everything that I can as a citizen of the greatest country in the world and as the chairman of a great committee with a great environmental history to make sure that we step up to this challenge. Just as we lift our children up to feed them and we hold them close to comfort them and to protect them from any manner of harm, just as we would never ever leave them trapped in a locked car in the hot sun, we must protect them from global warming. The ancient religious writings say, quote, see to it that you do not destroy my world, for there is no one to repair it after you. Unquote. Today, for us, it should be simple. Working together, we can reverse global warming. We must lead on this issue, not follow. It's our job. I truly believe when we do our job, our country and our families will be better and stronger and the world will be safer. Thank you very much.